What's up everyone and welcome back to another Starfield shipbuilding video. As seen in the thumbnail, we're going to be breaking down my Verge ship from the short that I released a couple weeks back. As always, I don't use mods or glitches with any of my ships, so nothing special is needed besides having a rank 4 piloting and starship design skill. I have been thinking about making ships with mods, so if that's something you want to see, let me know in the comments below. Like my previous videos, I've listed the parts needed on this screen and in the description below. Anyway, without further delay, let's move on to the build. We'll start at the front of the ship by attaching our Stroud nose cap to the front of our Deimos landing bay. Next, we'll attach our S204 cargo hold behind our landing bay and then place our all-in-one hab behind the Stroud nose cap. Now we're going to place all four Stroud Cap A variants to the left and right of the nose cap. We'll then place our fuel tank and reactor behind the Cap A pieces. For our three landing gears, we install them on both sides and behind the S204 cargo hold. With that done, we place the S202 cargo hold on each side of the ship behind the outer landing gears. Moving on, we place our side docker and storeroom on top of the outer landing gears. Then we'll put a Demo Spine F piece on top of both S202 cargo holds. Before we move on to the back of the ship, if you are enjoying this video, let me know by hitting that like button. I also make gaming content in general, so check out my other videos if you have time, and subscribe if you want to see future ones. Back to our build, we place two Stroud Cap B pieces on both sides of the ship behind the S202 cargo hold and spine F pieces. Our grab drive then gets placed in between the Cap B pieces and our shield generator gets mounted on top of the grab drive. The cockpit for this ship gets mounted right in front of our shield generator. For our engines, we place our Slayton SAE engines behind our grab drive and we place our Dunn engines behind the Cat B pieces. To finish off the final details of the ship, we are going to install our remaining Demo spine pieces to the left and right of our cockpit. With our ship completed, I do want to note some things. The first is that the stats of the ship will be slightly different depending on what rank your ship skills are at. Secondly, one change that I've considered was to replace the storeroom and spine pieces on the right with a 2x1 workshop hab so that I can modify weapons and gear on my ship. But I do like how the sides of the ship have a cutout look to it. And that brings us to the end of our video. If you did make it to the end, thank you for watching, like and subscribe.